asking random people random questions about sunscreen. Let's go. So I want to know if you apply sunscreen every day. Yes. Do you reapply the sunscreen? No. We've got a guy and I'm really curious to know if you wear a sunscreen every day. No, really. Actually. No girl in your life told you to apply sunscreen? No, no, did. If I told you it's really important to apply sunscreen, would you start applying sunscreen? Uh, no, actually, I'm okay with okay with uh, applying sunscreen, but I do have some doubts. I mean, uh, doubts regarding the same. I mean, like, I don't know how to use it because you know, uh, normally, gents won't apply sunscreens in a regular basis. I guess. I mean, while driving and all, I will use it in my hands, not in the face. Okay. So your primary concern is avoiding the tan. Yeah. Right. It also prevents aging. Did you know that? So the wrinkles. No, no, no. Okay. So. I don't know. Please apply sunscreen. Oh, sure. Do you apply sunscreen every day? Yeah, yeah, all day I will apply. Because sunscreen is a marine thing in my cosmetics item. Because it's a sun sunscreen is key or no. Yes. So it's a not avoid the item. It's most important item in sunscreen in this situation. Yes. Do you reapply sunscreen? Yeah. You reapply sunscreen? Yes. How often? It's a half one hour and one hour. So we're reapplying the sunscreen. Nice. Uh, do you apply it on top of your makeup? sometimes <laughs> okay perfect thank you do you apply sunscreen i do every single day every single day actually i do see a pimple patch and i'm just so <laughs> impressed i think like you've got your skincare game on point and i think it's probably because of you so i was like always wear sunscreen oh no i mean not always. say that again i'm like like i watch your videos all the time and i i think it's from your videos i first got the idea of applying sunscreen and then i think you were the one who said you should even apply it indoors yes, yes. so do okay do you reapply sunscreen um to be honest not all the time okay cuz i am a bit confused about how to reapply because i get oily very quick So I don't know if I should wipe it all off and then apply sunscreen, and what if I have makeup on? So those are good. Yeah, those are yeah. good questions. I will be answering that in this video. Yeah. So you actually apply sunscreen indoors as well? I do. Yeah. I'm so impressed. <laughs> Look at her. Look at her flawless skin, guys. No, it's not. <laughs> Hello my loves welcome back to my channel in today's video as you already know we are talking about sunscreens i actually went to the mall and asked you guys a random people sunscreen questions and it was very very interesting to know what you actually think because i've been sitting over here and making so many videos for years about sunscreen and i wanted to know how much of that message has come out to you guys and how many of you are actually wearing sunscreen now i'm very very happy to know that many of you actually wear sunscreens and you all have a little bit of doubt i also asked you guys on my instagram to shoot me your sunscreen questions and i have picked the top 5 questions so that's what this video is about so yeah if this is the very first time you're seeing this face hello i am jovita i would love it if you took a second to click that red subscribe button just underneath this video it really really helps me out guys and you will be notified every time i upload a video but you also have to engage with this video for i know i know it's a bit complicated so are you wondering if your question has been picked are you let's find out i constantly wonder if i'll stick on my teeth guys like like what I'm going to pick up my notes right over here. I've noted everything down and I just have to preface this video by saying that I'm so 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 happy with where we've come uh, in terms of sunscreen and the kind of sunscreens in the market guys. It's amazing. We have so many amazing sunscreens to choose from different kind lotions, gels, mineral, chemical. Let's get started with the very first question. So the first question is How do you reapply a sunscreen? This is such a fair question. If you are spending the entire day outside, then you have to reapply a sunscreen because one, it's really hot. You may have sweat off quite a chunk of the sunscreen because we keep wiping this part, this part, and two, the effectiveness of the sunscreen will kind of reduce within three hours. So it's best to reapply a sunscreen every three to four hours. There are a few different ways that you can reapply a sunscreen. We have 
amazing stick sunscreens right now you can use that for reapplying there are spray sunscreens that are available you can use that for reapplying there are also those powder mineral sunscreens you can use that for reapplying but you need to know that you do not get maximum protection with that you get very 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 faint amount of protection when you reapply a sunscreen like that but it is better than nothing so if you really do not want to wash your face and restart the whole routine those are definitely things that you can do otherwise what i like to do is take the sunscreen guys and actually just go go over my makeup with my fingers and i'm going to show you how i'm going to do it right now on top of my makeup take my sunscreen like that i kind of spread it on the back of my hand and then i start patting it onto my face okay i'm basically doing um the action that a cushion you know a cushion foundation would do if you have a cushion foundations cushion you can use a cushion foundation to you know reapply the foundation as well so when you do it like this you're not smearing your blush and your contour and your highlighter you are just you know patting that onto your face and you don't have to worry about the gray cast if you use a really nice sunscreen without gray cast like the one from deconstruct i will be talking about this sunscreen just in a minute and i am just dabbing this on to my makeup just like that if i feel like a little bit of rubbing is required you know gently with my finger i can blend it a little gentler underneath the eyes you know kind of mimicking how i would apply my concealer i just finished reapplying my sunscreen all over my face and my makeup is not smudged it still looks fresh so that is how i prefer reapplying sunscreen during the day look i mean seriously guys look at that the foundation is has not moved no oiliness no shininess it looks absolutely fine and this is how you reapply your sunscreen now can i talk about the sunscreen that i just used the one that i used right now is the deconstruct gel sunscreen with broad spectrum protection spf of 55 plus pa plus 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 i love how lightweight this is how comfortable this is on the skin and this is for all skin types oily normal sensitive no matter what your preference is it has such a gel you know lightweight airy you it doesn't make you sweat i hate sunscreens that further make you sweat and this definitely does not another sunscreen that i really really like from deconstruct i also like to apply this on my body because the skin on my body is slightly drier i prefer more lotiony sunscreens on my body and more gel and even lotion on my face this is the deconstruct sunscreen lotion this is actually even water resistant that does not mean waterproof so you cannot jump into the pool but you can sweat and if you just dab off the sweat it is water resistant that means it will still resist wiping off of your face which is absolutely amazing for these hot humid months with a little bit of drizzle and rain you still need to wear sunscreen during monsoon and drizzles and rains by the way the harmful rays of uv still kind of cuts through the clouds you know anyways the sunscreen lotion comes with spf of 55 plus pa plus 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 four pluses this is also giving you broad spectrum protection and this also contains niacinamide for further skin benefits i like the lotion texture of it it has still a gel gel like you know what we like about a gel that lightness the airiness but it also has a little bit more hydrating quality if you have oily skin you can definitely skip out on moisturizer you can start your day with a vitamin c serum or whatever serum it is that you like and apply loads of sunscreen and that is enough for your day routine of your face it just makes your skin care so so easy both these sunscreens are paraben free silicone free fragrance free phthalate free cruelty free sls free and vegan the gel sunscreen will cost you 349 rupees and the lotion sunscreen will cost you 379 rupees both for a 50 gram tube and i think that is an absolutely amazing value for money you do not have to feel bad about reapplying it constantly and sun protection is 
Something we definitely need, guys. And that takes me to question number two. Jovi, is sunscreen really, really necessary? We are going to age faster if you do not apply a sunscreen. We are obviously going to get hyperpigmentation if you do not like the tan. We had a whole discussion <laughs> about it in this video. But, um, you know, uneven skin tanning, nobody wants that. You know, keeping aside the value of skin color, keeping aside all of that, uh, skin tanning is damage to the skin. So uneven skin tanning tanning and skin tanning in general and um, the dark spots if you are prone to hyperpigmentation sun can cause the hyperpigmentation to darker darken if you have melasma that can darken so it is not a myth and you cannot apply coconut oil and ca drink carrot juice to <laughs> build sun protection naturally anymore uh, because we live in a very very different time these days the third question or the third concern that I got is that uh, I'm a guy I don't wear sunscreen well you know sunscreen because of the reasons that I just mentioned it is not gender specific four is the concern that it makes me look gray or it makes me sweat guys there are so many amazing amazing sunscreens in the market like the deconstruct one I will leave links for this down in the description bar below these sunscreens are sweat resistant because they are water resistant some sunscreen formulations I've noticed when you apply it makes you sweat more these guys do not do that it is so comfortable on your face you do not sweat excessively because of the sunscreen because of the heat obviously this is not like you know it will not it's not a deodorant for your face you know or a anti perspirant for your face these also do not make you look gray or blue even if you have deeper skin tone and finally the fifth question that I got is should we apply sunscreen indoors well, a really great question. So in my house, uh, the I do not get a lot of direct sunlight, okay? I don't. Uh, my plants die. <laughs> so in a place like that, I don't really have to apply a, a sunscreen that is really strong. If I have a moisturizer with SPF for 15 or 30, that minimal protection is enough. If you have huge, large white walls and if you have reflective floors, uh, whatever sunlight that gets into the house is also going to bounce off of these reflective surfaces and hit you and cause the damages. So like an SPF of 50, SPF of 30, you can even get away with it if you always have your blinds closed, curtains closed, you do not need a sunscreen. But if you are, you know, you have large windows and you have a lot of natural daylight coming into your house, this is if you are house, house like indoors, yeah, of course, that was the question. <laughs> I just forgot the, what the question was. Anyways, if you have large windows, you have a lot of... Uh, first of all, I'm very, very jealous of you. I wish I had that natural light flowing in because my plants are dying. Anyways, coming back to the point, you need sunscreen indoors. You know, if you have these huge windows or if you sit by a window, um, even at work, you have the, the beautiful sunlight hitting your face or your arm, you need to protect your self and you need to do the whole reapplication especially on the side that you are getting the sun exposure if if you are sitting in an office and you know that if it is in your home just apply guys you can wash your face and reapply if you are at home you know it's easy to reapply my goodness what over explanation <laughs> Anyways, these are the top five questions answered for you. If you have any more questions regarding sunscreen, guys, uh, please feel free to drop them down in the comment section below and I will be more than happy to answer them for you. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have a friend who is still resisting the whole idea of sunscreen, send this video across to them so that we can change the world and we can have a whole world of healthy skin. Brown, beautiful, healthy skin. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. A huge, huge thanks to Deconstruct for sponsoring this video and uh, supporting my channel, you know. Uh, helps me pay my bills, guys. Helps me pay my bills. <laughs> and thank you for watching and supporting as well. I love you so much. Stay safe, stay in the sun and stay happy. I love you. Mwah. Bye.